Kimball Musk uh, said that uh, food is the new internet. And I can really relate to this statement because um, food is a $5 billion industry. Um, and there is a lot of problems with the food we are currently uh, consuming. And it continues like that. In the next uh, 30 years, there will be more food consumed than in the last 10,000 years combined. So I think that th the current way that, um, that, the, that the countryside is growing the food for the city, that doesn't work anymore. I think the city needs to be part of our food production in the future. And uh, I think that um, this notion that we change that, uh, this, needs to change, uh, this, this needs to happen in our head because agriculture at the moment uses 70% of our drinking water. Um, it, it is a big threat to biodiversity because we are mainly growing corn world, worldwide um, to feed, to feed uh, cows so we can eat a lot of beef um, and to support our current lifestyle. So it's a big threat to biodiversity and it's just not healthy for, for our natural environment. And I think to make a change can happen first that we try to eat local that we try to eat regional, and if we, cannot, if we don't have the space for growing our own vegetables, then at least that we support local farmers uh, to grow their vegetables. Um, but I also think that as people, um, we need to take back the, the, the ownership of our food. At the moment, um, all of our food belongs to maybe uh, five uh, big, huge corporations, like Monsanto or Nestle or, uh, or, um, uh, <coughs> yeah, or Bayer, for example. So all of those are big chemical uh, corporations uh, who own all of our food. But I think that good or real food is not a luxurious. It's not a commodity. It's a basic human right. So I think this notion that we have to take care of our own food, um, it needs to go back into our heads. Um, on, the, on the other hand, then also, if you plant vegetables uh, on your, uh, uh, in your private uh, balconies, it also cools down the building in a natural ventilation. It is, the city already produces a lot of energy. That means that the city produces a lot of heat already. And warmth is good for certain vegetables like tomatoes, nut trees, beans, uh, and so forth. And all of this one can then, the energy can be reused basically uh, to grow your vegetables uh, on the facade and to cool down the building. And in this way also the, 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 the building itself is not anymore an island in the city. It connects to the city because whatever is produced on the top of the building, it can be given to a larger community. It can be sold to its surrounding. So it's, the connection is passing past the doorman. And I think that is a very uh, beautiful way of maybe how we can uh, coordinate and uh, agriculture and architecture and maybe both of those industries can benefit from each other.